देखिए जिसे हम सुबह दी वे वी हैड टोल्ड इन दी मॉर्निंग दैट देर वाज बिट ऑफ कंफ्यूजन यस्टरडे रिगार्डिंग दी नंबर ऑफ डेथ्स दैट हैज बीन क्लारिफाइड इन द मॉर्निंग एंड आज पर दी रिपोर्ट ऑफ कलेक्टर बालेश्वर व्हिच ही हैज कंफर्म्ड इन दी टर्म्स ऑफ ए लेटर दैट दी नंबर इज 275 टिल 10 एम व्हिच हैज बीन कंफर्म्ड Uh, thereafter, uh, we have not received any further report. But if there is any report, we will certainly say there is nothing to hide. And, uh, the, and the entire uh, operation, uh, we are grateful that public as well as the media friends, the entire operation has been done in presence of everybody and with support and cooperation of all the local public. And the state administration uh, is thankful to the public of Baleswar Bahanaga area to provide uh, that degree of support in the entire operation. Of the 275 uh, dead bodies, uh, uh, almost 108 dead bodies have been identified in the meanwhile and uh, they are being, uh, uh, some have been already transferred and others are in the process of transfer. In Baleswar, we were hopeful of transferring all the 85, but because though the bodies have been identified in four cases, uh, but some of the relations, they are waiting for more of their relations to come to pick up the bodies. So therefore, uh, in order to avoid decay and further deterioration, four dead bodies, four dead bodies we are, we are uh, uh, transferring to Bhuneswar. So from here, we will dispatch the, we will we'll, uh, transfer the dead bodies to the destination when their relatives come and uh, they are in unison. I have a single, uh, there is convergence regarding transfer. So in the AIMS uh, also, uh, Bhuneshwar, uh, 23 dead bodies have been identified in the meanwhile and uh, uh, transport process is going on and two have just been identified. The, the transport process has not yet set in, just it has been identified. So this is the process button. And in order to help people to uh, gather more information about the dead and the injured, we have uh, issued two toll free numbers 1800345061 and 1929. Both these numbers are now national toll free numbers. People from anywhere in the country can ring up these two numbers and contact uh, our uh, uh, the officers uh, to share uh, further information regarding dead and uh, the injured who are under treatment right now. And we have also issued, the, we have also posted the photographs of uh, some uh, the dead uh, persons, uh, though their uh, though viewers' discretion would be exercised, in the three websites, www.osdma.org, www.srcodisa.nic.in, and www.bmc dot gov dot in. In these three websites, photographs are there with viewers description, with certain disclaimer, people should uh, uh, view these uh, images, children should be, uh, we don't encourage children to view these images, because some of them are quite disturbing. And uh, this information, uh, these, these images shall only be utilized for the purpose of identification and for no other purpose, that is the disclaimer. Uh, including media cannot use these photographs for any other purpose. So, um, and uh, phys physically what we have done, anybody who contacts us, 122 people have already contacted in our toll free numbers. So, anybody who is uh, contacting us, we are advising them to visit Bhuneshwar as early as possible. And uh, or those who view these websites and decide to come, we would uh, appeal through your channel that they should do it fast and uh, so that we can identify the bodies faster and we can transfer the bodies to the respective destination uh, by making special arrangement uh, by the state government. The entire uh, exercise of uh, sending the bodies from Odisha to the respective destination uh, will, be by, will be borne by the state government. So uh, we will only appeal that as, as soon as uh, this exercise is done, it will be better. And once people come to Bhuneswar, in Bhuneswar airport, as well as in railway station, we have made help desks where the, our officers will receive them and provide all logistic support, including transport and uh, accommodation, 
to take them around uh, the hospitals to so that they can see the bodies they can see the their injured relations and if they identify the bodies again process of transfer uh, and uh, sifting will be done by the state and in case the bodies are not identified there are some bodies which are uh, left without identification then the process of medical legal uh, uh, thing would con uh, would start so today uh, on the basis of uh, the talk between honorable chief minister and honorable prime minister yesterday uh, a team of 17 professionals from uh, government of india have arrived in a air force special plane in the morning and they will embalm the dead bodies and before that dna sampling is required so our state forensic science laboratory is doing the dna sampling at which embalming uh, is uh, processes for done our objective is that uh, as early as possible we should identify the bodies and dis uh, either transfer them or dispose them however uh, with the help of government of india we are trying to embalm so that maybe another one or two days three days we will try to return the bodies uh, so that people can people still can come and identify the process so after a reasonable time if uh, nobody turns off for identification then uh, we'll take a decision as to how do we dispose of the bodies so that is uh, what so, has also announced a free bus service yes so what has happened many train services uh, have been short closed in bhuvaneswar they are terminated in bhuvaneswar and uh, katak and puri so passengers are stranded to go to Calcutta. So uh, realizing this, Anubhul Chief Minister has directed that till the train uh, uh, services are normalized, uh, which should take another one or two days at least, so state government will provide free bus service to Calcutta. And uh, from Bhuvaneswar, Puri and Katak, these three railway stations, bus services will be available so that stranded passengers can, without any problem, uh, reach uh, Kolkata. Uh, that that is the thing and uh, we have uh, our own control room here in uh, uh, this office uh, manned by very senior officers uh, including chief secretary additional chief secretaries and other principal secretaries uh, and uh, in the bmc again of senior officers uh, we are managing 24 by 7 uh, control rooms and we are ready to walk that extra mile to make uh, the entire process as uh, smooth as we can